found what I'm looking for. This is I'm looking for this waterfall. I've got to go back up the top to go around, and I want to abseil in above there. Because in above there is, I'm pretty sure with that, that little gap. When I call through once, and I don't know what I call through again, I just want to look at it. But I have actually, I have actually abseiled down off there into that water and swam out through here. So, I can't remember the abseil, I think it'd be just abseil straight off that tree, it wasn't a big, a little, big abseil, just a small one. Look, what, look at where we are here, bloody amazing in here. I seem to be the only one around. If I come up on that side, I just had to swap over. Oh. Up above there. Beautiful place. Yeah, I remember that water was pretty cold. And that was in uh, January I did it. Must have been January 17, I think. Was it 17? I think so. Anyway, that's it. This here is actually the first spot of the last car. I went on a tour guide, and the tour guide's here now. I finally got ropes to do monkey face, and they're all going to monkey face. So hopefully lunchtime I'll be gone, they might go over to Jack Creek Falls. So hopefully I'll still get to have some monkey face. But my peers are full of natural art, and um, I said first time I've abseiled, I've abseiled here, and I'm going to abseil again every day. It's been a few years since I'm the first time I was here, and come a bit of a way from the abseil with me. Have a look. I'm going to come down through that hole up there. If I feel clean enough, I'll go over the front. It's a, it's a good spot here, it's a nice walk in. I've seen a live bird so far, a couple of uh, a couple of bush turkeys, scrub turkeys, and it's only about a 1.2k walk in here or something, it's not far. It's a nice little walk though. Anyway, I'm heading up there. She is down in there. It's an easy abseil really. Just straight down there. I have gone over that front edge before. Whether I do it today or not, I'm actually going to abseil this here. Then I'm going to go up further and abseil into the creek into a spot that gives me the cold shivers. So I'm going to hook up an anchor under this tree here and I'm going to go down near there. It should be fun. I've had to anchor to a smaller tree behind because my sling's three metres and that big tree that the anchor off is huge. But I'm pretty sure that small tree behind is going to be enough to hold me. So good luck. I'm all ready to go. Just got to drop my rope down through there. Down through there. Cool ass. I'm such a sook when it comes to anchors. I put the sling on, another tape, and another piece of rope. I'm pretty sure that tree's going on, but I'll tie it back to another tree. Anyway, I'm going down there. Look at this. That's cool. I got my backpack on basically because I was going to leave it up the top but it's got on me safety gear and uh, first aid kit, bar and a whole lot so I thought what the hell, I'll just take it all down. I've done before, climbed cliffs and left my backpack at the bottom. Down there's where we're going. Hopefully my rope will reach long enough. Little cool spot. Yeah, it looks straight up there while I come down through there. I have been over the front of that which I might even just do again. I haven't really explored along there though, it looks pretty good. I'm sure you can set up other abs house. That's a cool place. If you look down behind me, you'll see where I'm going. Down there is pretty easy. Nice little abs out. Look at the bugs, all the wasps or something hanging up there. Another view. That's an awesome rock face. Look at that big cave up there. Big trees. Pretty straightforward. Bit of rope left. The track walks in. Just 
going back up. Damn, pretty. So, the plan is, right down there is that little gap. So I called to constant for my church and I got that. I want to add far down here. I don't know what's in there, but the only way I'm going to get out without getting wet is to pass it back up. Which is not that far. It's not that far, so I won't know exactly what it looks like until I get right to the edge. Look at this picture. So, here's, here's the gap down there. Down in there. Is that gap? I, I can't believe I crawled under that. I really can't. Well, I made it in here. There's my roads just there. I found the easiest way to get in here, really. But, getting there's going to be a bit of a bugger. Plus, you can back up there, but anyway, I'll get it. If you look down there, that's where I was earlier. And I think this is where we've come down when I've done this canyon before. I haven't come through that gap, gone underneath that gap in the rock, which I'm going to have a look at in a minute. And then we come through here. I'm pretty sure I climbed up in there over that. And then we have tailed down over through into there. So if I can't get back up my rope, I'm going to get wet. Because <laughs> the only way to get out is go for a swim. I should be careful here. This is pretty slippery, I think. Looks pretty slippery. So as you can see down there, I've had sailed down into that pond and then just swam out of there. So it's beautiful in here. Definitely a nice place. I'll take a couple of photos and then I'll go and have a look at that gap underneath the rock. I can't fucking believe I crawled through that hole. Damn, just looking at it makes me... Oh, oh dear. I actually crawled through there. I crawled through that little gap from the other side. On the other side over there, wherever it comes from, from over there, I crawl underneath that rock and come out there. Nice big pool though, if it's warm you get a little bit of a swim in there. Big caddies in there. Some big caddies there, there's this big pile of them right there. I gotta walk a bit ginger around here because I don't want to end up in the water. The you know, camera seems to pick up a bit of glare these days too, I don't know why. So yeah, that was my plan to get in here, add sail into here and have a look at that hole. Well I got myself out. Uh, luckily in video it was a bit nerdy. Anyway, it was too fun. Went down, went in, did what I wanted to do, had a look around, took some video, it was fun. A little bit of an outside, a couple of ledges, but climbing back out was a pain in the ass. Anyway, I'm out there, so it's all good.